Hello everybody, my name is Erin and I'll be teaching you Photoshop. And today I'm going to show you how to use the flame filter. With this tool, I would call it, uh, you can add some nice looking flames to your boring image. For example, if you have a, if, if you have a small campfire which is not burning and does not has one big fire you can add this in post so let's get to it for this example i will be using a normal uh, black background layer and since we do not want to destroy our nice little black background i will start by adding a transparent layer now for this tool to work we need a path so we need to select the pen tool for that that's the little old school pen icon here in the left we can also reach it by pressing the shortcut p and we will draw a nice little path to work with so now we have our path and we go to filter render flame let's say set this to default to start with now the length of the flames can be influenced the shape of the flame can be influenced so we can do a candlelight like flame we can do multiple flames going everywhere that which looks like this now we need to increase the length a bit, bit to show you what it does and let's randomize the length so you have different lengths of flames which looks more natural um, we can do multiple flames in one direction which looks like this and we can change the width of the flame so we have more broader flames bigger flames we can change the angle so they will rotate left or right this way and we can change the interval with this we with this we increase the space between the flames now we can also add some color to the flame so for example if we have a blue themed or fantasy style image we can add for example blue flames then we go to use color use custom color for flames we check this box and now it will use red which or orange which it already is so we go in here we get our nice little color picker window and we will select a nice blue color like this for example now we press ok and you will see the color or the color of the flames will turn blue now these are only basic settings now there is an advanced tab I will not go into this uh, in this tutorial um, I can do that in a, in, a, in, a, in another tutorial if you guys like please let me know in the comments for now uh, we will go back to the basic tab now we made our uh, flames like this and now I would like to use this so I'll press ok Photoshop will start to render my flames and here they are now we can throw away the path by hitting escape several times it just disappears we go to the move tool by pressing the icon up here or the V for, mo for the move tool since we created a new layer we can just take them up put them everywhere in our image and adjust afterwards the only thing we cannot do is put the flames in a smart object so we can change the flames afterward we can still make them bigger by transforming them for that press ctrl t or command t for mac you'll see you can increase your flames but since the quality does not match the your pixel rate does not match the quality of your image you will see a pixely image so I would not recommend that if you 
want to want it to be bigger just change your settings re-render your flame if you like my tutorials please consider subscribing to my channel so i can keep up with this work and it's a big motivation for me so please hit that subscribe button i would love to see my channel grow like everybody does and this also stimulates me to keep pushing out the content and these kind of tutorials thank you for watching and i'll be teaching you the next time